Good morning. How are you today? Um, yes, we're going to do a suit fitting for your space suit. Well, this is the first for me, too. I've never given anybody a uh, exact measurement like this. I'm curious how it'll turn out. You'll have to forgive me, I'm a little under the weather today. you'd like I can wear gloves to keep us a little more sterile because I'm going to be touching a lot of areas to get proper measurements that you may not be comfortable with and I do apologize for that ahead of time. I, I would like to apologize. Is that all right? Okay. Well, because we don't know exactly how things work in space, we're going to have to get some very accurate measurements. First one I want to get is around your head. And we want to make sure when we do this measurement, we measure several places around your head. And the reason being to get a really good look at your exact dimensions. And we want to We want to know how your particular head is shaped. Not everybody's head is shaped the same way. No, I'm serious. Some people have an egg head shape and some have a very round Charlie Brown shape. So we want to get a lot of measurements like circumferences from the top of your head to your chin. And we want to write those down. I'm also writing down some notes. So that we can remember what we were measuring exactly. Why? This is a very tight fitting astronaut costume. Mm hmm. A lot of head measurements. There's padding in there. There's padding that goes inside the helmet and it has to fit perfectly or it'll be too tight. Then the padding won't work. It won't um, protect you protect your cranium as much as it would normally. There we go. Now we're going to 
measure your shoulders. Well, I don't think there's any such thing as space aliens. We haven't discovered extraterrestrial life anywhere outside of the Earth, so I really don't think we have to worry about aliens suddenly appearing out of nowhere. What? No, I don't. I don't think there's anybody else here but you and I. Oh, my hip is so stiff. Did you ever sleep wrong and your hip is really stiff? My hip is just killing me, and um, I have this cream I put on, like Ben Gay, that kind of helps my hip. What? <clears throat> oh, it's like a lotion. No. I didn't see any. There's nobody here. Yeah. Well, you've taken your psych evaluation test, and... Uh, you pass with flying colors, so I don't know why you you feel the need to. There's no aliens here. Okay, let's get your shoulders. I just want to measure right across here. There we go. Um, I didn't see anything. Where was it at? Behind you. I just want to get this measurement right here. Okay, hold still. And then we're going to go around your chest. All right, hold still as you can. All right. No, I, I'm honest. Um, well, there is over there, there's something, but I don't know what it is. But I didn't see any aliens. What do you mean? I didn't see anything. Oh my goodness, I am uh, have to agree with you. I uh, just realized that myself. But I don't see anything. Yeah. Well, if you do, you want me to continue? Oh, okay. Well, could you put your arm out like this? Okay. I'm just gonna measure your arm. Your other arm, I want to measure, maybe it'd be easier to do it this way. There we go. And uh, I want to get you under the armpit from here to here, this area. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm not sure. Is your heart rate okay? I'm telling you, I don't see anything, but I'll look around the room. <clears throat> but I, I haven't seen anything that would make me think that there's an alien in the room. Do you? I'm... Are you sure? Okay. All right. It's all right. Take your temperature. I'm feeling a little warm. Sightable. Are you sure you're all right? I'm not seeing anything. Well, we can continue this measuring process, but I think you're... Well, okay. All right, well, let's get around the waist then. All right. Right, right here around the, mid, the midsection in the chest. Okay. All right, and then we're going to measure around your waist. Just throw that tape around there. Okay. There we go. Some decent measurements. Write those down real quick. Just want to write those down. A hot? What'd you say? I don't understand. Oh, okay. 
No, just I'll just write these down real quick. What? No, I didn't see anything. Okay. Um, I'm unsure. You see, was it uh, you saw a little green man from Mars? Okay, um, you, you know how that sounds to me when I'm measuring you for a spacesuit. We're gonna put you on. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to bump you. We're gonna put you on top of an Atlas rocket, we're gonna fire you into outer space, and you think you're seeing. Little green men from Mars before we've even set you up. You can tell that this is not a good, a good sign. Okay. All right. All right. Well, let's get the your instep. Okay. All right. Just hold still. I think I can get it here. Just bend over here. Okay. I'll warm up the tip. <laughs> We're gonna stick it up in there. Let me get that measurement. All right, and what? What did you see? Are you serious? No, I was down there. I wasn't. Well, let me get the measurement. <sighs> okay, um, and then we're gonna stick that in there and get your instep on your leg. All right. Okay. All right. You're gonna be calm now. Okay. Stay calm. All right. We're gonna get that measurement. And what? Where? I don't see anything. Um, I'm not saying anything to anybody. Okay. Do you know what shoe size you wear? All right. Let me get that down. I don't know if we should even continue at this point. You seem so nervous and agitated. Well, I've got to get like some measurements around your thighs and your calves. Are you going to be all right with that? How about if you sit down and we'll do it that way? Okay, sit down and just do it that way. Okay. Okay. Here's your thigh length. And around the thigh, the circumference. Sometimes your legs don't match up. Okay, so the thigh. And then around the thigh. There we go. Okay. Okay. Very good. Write those down. Did you see anything? Nothing. Okay. Okay. I'm feeling very confident about this. Well, you never know. It just, it just could be nerves. It really could. It could just be nerves. You know, people get scared. No, really. I mean, you never know what you're, what you're going to um, see when you're, you know, in a strange place, you know? But, uh, no, I mean, I never thought you were one of those guys that was going to crack up, you know, just because you thought you saw a space alien. You know, with like a laser gun pointing it at your face. You're not that kind of guy. But I w never thought that of you, you know. Okay. All right. So you don't see anything.
You sure you don't see anything at all? Okay. Let me check. Uh, I want to get a quick look around your neck. fever or you might have a flu. A little bit of a flu bug. Is that possible? It's possible. Okay. Let me just check around your head again. There we go. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I know. It's troubling. No, 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 no. I I understand. I understand. That's why we do this. That's why we go through the screening process. We don't want anybody going up in outer space that uh, is nervous or scared. No, I know you're not scared. I know, wait. I know you're not afraid to go in outer space. I know. Calm down. Okay. We've got to measure your hands now. Okay? Um, it's very important so the gloves fit properly. Because in the vacuum of space, the gloves don't work for the same as they do on Earth. Okay, so put your hand out and we're going to measure, you know, each digit and get some decent. There we go, so we're measuring that part of your palm and the circumference of your hand. I think you're going to be a great astronaut if um, you ask me. You seem very intent on being a, uh, a real trooper. I wonder if you got my cold. So what we're going to do here is I'm going to draw you the different parts of the spacesuit and I'll show you how the spacesuit it's going to fit, you know, where the actual measurements that we took are going to come off the spacesuit. And we, got, we have to uh, stay calm. I know you're a little bit worked up right now, but it's all right. You can stick out your tongue if you need to. Do you think you're sick? Okay, we can check. We can check. Hold on. Heartbeat seems very strong. I, uh, I think you're a little over, over stimulated, and uh, we're gonna take a few micrometer readings on your eyes mm -hmm. and your nose. Hold still as possible. And then your ear shape. Just a few micrometer readings. Okay? I know it's I know it's
it's unnerving to think you see something and have hallucinations, but I think you have to try to stay as calm as possible in this situation. All right. Just take a couple more drinks. All right. No, no, no. It's okay to be upset. You definitely think you see something, and I'm not one to judge. I'm just here to help you get s uh, fitted for your suit and check your medical condition, which I can tell you're highly agitated. And it's obvious that you've, you know, you've had a nervous problem. We don't want you to feel like we don't care. I just got to write those down. No, I'm writing everything down. No, not that. It's okay. It's all right. No, I, I can't show you what I'm writing down. I can't. It's, it's, it's technical jargon. Almost done. Okay, without reading any of this document at all, I'll just hold my hand over this area. Can you sign right there? Right there. Okay, just, thank you. Oh, no, no, there's nothing in there except just your measurements. We just wanted your signature to verify that all the, um, could you initialize right here? Right here. There. Okay. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're real good. Okay, yeah. So, I really want you to know that I appreciate all of your help today. Oh no, no, you've been uh, you've been great, and um, yeah, I think we're gonna be just fine. Um, we're gonna get that suit fitted up for you right away, so you can try it on. Uh, this is a new suit. It's it's a great suit. It's actually, um, it's very comforting, and it, it uh, helps you calm down. It actually it's like being in one big hug. You just feel like you're constantly being hugged. It's a great suit. Yeah, lots of straps, uh, buckles. I know guys like buckles and straps on their suits. You know, it's very fashionable. But you'll really like it. Mm -hmm. It has a little tie between the legs to keep you, the whole thing, you know, in place. Yeah. Excellent. Well, it was very good to meet you today. Yes. I wish you the best of luck on your launch. Mm-hmm. And I hope everything works out all right for you. Yeah. I hope nothing bad happens. No. No, 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 no. Everything's going to be just fine.
Well, it was a pleasure to meet you today. It really was. And, uh, happy launch. Yeah, there you go. Shake hands. Okay, and, yeah, you can, you can go out that door. The door you came in. Right there, there's... Yeah, there's... They're going to take you to the next test. They're waiting for you over there. Yeah. Okay. All right. Take care. Okay. Goodbye. All right. Okay. Right on. All right. Um... Okay, um, I guess that's today's session. Until we see you again, this is Dr. Andrew Michaels wishing you a wonderful, safe day. And until we meet again, please have a, a most blessed day.